So let's continue with the bitwise operator and in this video we'll talk about left and right shift operator. Now to demonstrate left and right shift operator let me take two variables or only one variable which is let's say x and the value of x is uh, let's say 16. Okay so we have a value which is x so variable x and the value is 16 and what we'll do is we'll use x and we'll use a left shift operator. So when you say angular bracket 2 times angular bracket which is less 2 less than sign which is equal which is actually a left shift operator and we can say left shift operator by 2 what we will simply do is so this expression here which is shift the value of this shift the bits of x by 2 on the left hand side so let's say you have a value which is uh, x 16 so 16 binary format is this so this is 1 and 4 zeros so when you say you want to shift it on the left side, so imagine there is a virtual dot here. So we need to shift this, this on the left side by two zeros. So in total, we have one and six zeros, which is, which is actually 64. So the value of result will be 64. So if I run this, you can see the answer is 64. Simple. So that, that is how we use left shift operator. Now let's see what is right shift operator. So now, your 16 is this value and we have a virtual dot here. So when I apply a right shift operator, which means if I apply a right shift operator here, it will shift my bits on the left, right hand side. So it will shift these two bits on the right hand side, which will delete it. And it will give you one double zero, which is actually four. So if I run this code now, you will, getting, you will be getting a value which is four. Simple. So that's how we use left shift and right shift operator in bitwise operators.